So what's the plan from where you sit today and becoming walking into the presidency? Number one, my plan is to unite the Haitian. Not just the Haitian in Haiti. We, we are more than 12 million of people in Haiti and 20, uh, 27,000 kilometers quarry like Belgium. It's the, the same size like Belgium, yeah. if you're in the Belgium. But at the same time, we have a big majority community in the diaspora. We are more than 5 million of Haitians in the diaspora. In the diaspora? Yes. Wow. And just the gift Western Union transfer from mm -hmm. Haitian to the diaspora annually is more than 40% of the GBT of the economy, the Look national budget. Look at that. So for me, Ghana is a kind of inspiration for me. I'm coming here to learn, to understand the model, how you're overcoming, how you can st stabilize your, your country, pacify it. Because I'm more than one more here. I never see in the street people fighting, yelling. It's very peace country. We need security in our country right now. One of my concern is not just motivate our Asian people in Haiti, but also say the diaspora. Let's stand together. Let's rebuild our nation. Okay. And for that, I'm asking the all African leaders. Because you know, you and Chwai in Haiti, it's fell. More than five times you and Chwai. Uh, World Bank try in Haiti, failing. France, Canada, US, all of them try to bring something in Haiti. Police, they change police, uh, army to make police. The democracy fell in Haiti. Now we have a, to have a new approach. I ask in the African Union, the all leaders in Africa, business people, let's see Haiti like our brothers and sisters. We need a leadership of African to say something in this table. And I believe Haitian, Haitian leaders are ready to listen to African leaders. Okay. Because you know more the problem we face. Many countries overcoming in Africa. I think we can learn a lot by your experience. How after the colonization, how you overcome to pacify and to have some good direction today to rebuild your nations. You know, the AU has the sixth region that involves uh, countries in the diaspora that are predominantly diaspora. Uh, and it's Haiti, it's 100% black. It seemed to me that you, your connection to uh, African Union is probably a, a stronger one than with the individual countries in Africa. Yes, sir. Have you looked at uh, building a relationship with the African Union in Addis Ababa? No, see, uh, that is one of my aspirations because we know Africa has 54 countries. Yeah. Why we can say 55th? Because Haiti is African. It's the country of Africa. If so, you so wait, you're, you're <laughs> saying that Haiti should be admitted as an individual member of yes, the African Union. that is the way I see Not it. Not with the sixth region, but as one of the 55th. The 50, the 50, 50, exactly. Interesting. Exactly. How, what, what argument would you use to back that up? Number one, the culture. Because we are the only black African country independent like Ghana outside the continent. That, you know what? That's interesting. I haven't <laughs> looked at it like that. Because if you go to Jamaica, Trinidad and Tobago, you know, they're all mixed race. Mixed race. Mixed race exactly. And sometimes you have a black president, sometimes you have a white. But you, it's all black. Normally, we can have like 15% or 10%, you know, or the nation. Uh -huh. But all of them and their mindset, they're, they're Asian, they're black. That is our constitution. You so, can have right color. Uh -huh. If you are Asian, you are black. That is the constitution. Is that their mindset? That is the mindset. So the Polish who came to fight and they decided to fight. They're Haitian now. They're Haitian. All of them in their mindset, they're Haitian. They're not that white. It's amazing. It, that's so a, that the relation. Reason, that, sorry, that yeah. reason, racism not touch too much Haitian. Okay. Because for her, everybody is black. Okay. <laughs> so the, you don't have any racial problems inside Haiti? Of course. We have what we call, uh, uh, you know, uh, who... The class The, the class supremacy. Yeah. Uh, they, they take the superior because they have some color. But those people is more people, immigrant from uh, uh, Arabic countries. They're coming in Haiti, they have success, and now they have some complexity about colorship. But if you go in the fundamental of Haiti, we are all black. Interesting. 